Hello everyone, this is Snoopy Holly and today I'm going to show you my tea scrapbook which is this um, yeah it's quite thick and while I'm doing it I'm gonna drink tea uh, orange chocolate from Lupicia the Japanese tea brand Should be quite good, I think. So let's get it. Uh, it looks like this uh, with the black tea loose leaves and also some orange peel, and it has a really, really uh, refreshing orange. Aroma and um, yeah, I I'm quite excited. Let's just put the leaves here. This cup is very convenient. It has uh, two parts with the just milk cup and then the this part which can hold the tea leaves. So once you put the leaves in, you just pour the hot water and it's the tea will be ready very simple and nice okay so put the lid on back and uh, yeah just uh, wait for probably two or three minutes I guess and while we are waiting, let me show you my tea scrapbook, like I said. This way, maybe it's here. So this scrapbook I've been keeping for several years now. And that's why it got really, really thick. I have to have this elastic band to uh, not make sure it's uh, put together not like blow up or anything and um, yeah I've been drinking lots of tea and it has a this shows my kind of history of the tea drinking and uh, yeah of course lots of tea bags yeah, 4 o'clock is tea time. And I have lots of uh, kind of chocolate things here because I, one, I found them very attractive, two, they go well with the tea. So yeah, this is from Switzerland and yeah, I got it from my friend in Switzerland. And some kind of leads that I collected from the coffee shop. And these are random small stickers that I could get from the either tea, tea box or tea, um, tea food or cookies and everything. And these uh, labels are uh, custom labels are the uh, the tea that I got from other people and this is one of my favorite Ebi Senbei from Japan it's the uh, wrapping paper from there and yeah all this tea bag I, I found this series really pretty with the strawberry and illustration so I, I just put them together here Oh, and then I made this uh, for Christmas. I made this with uh, all these tea bags, uh, like green kind of, and then Merry Christmas here. And <laughs> these are kind of a representative as a gift under the Christmas tree. Oops. And uh, yeah, I really like this as a 
uh, with making it with the milk tea and I really enjoy them while I drink them I got this from France I think and this is uh, from Mariaju it's the it's their tea list they have this huge list of uh, variety of uh, tea and oh wow this is quite this looks quite strong let me taste it okay I'm gonna add some water because I, I waited too long I think too strong Okay, much better. Yeah, it has a nice uh, orange aroma and taste, and it's not too heavy. It's refreshing. I quite like it. And yes, I I really like Mariage Frere, and I only wish it, this is not too expensive in Korea. But unfortunately, um, it's quite pricey to get in Korea. And yeah, some more boxes. And this is famous, um, uh, like uh, red bean based, uh, red uh, the 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 cake, soft cake with the red bean inside in Gyeongju. That's really famous. And another tea bag selections. And this candy I had. I think this was with the honey and the lemon. I really, really enjoyed it, so I, I put this here, <laughs> and um, on a, another chocolate. And this is the was the bread, the Casella bread from Nagasaki, Japan. And I really enjoyed this uh, chocolate and cookie combined together. It, I got it from my friend. In Switzerland, and um, this is quite famous, uh, uh, like snack in Japan. Pretz. It, it's a long stick cookie, and um, it has various uh, taste. Kit Kat is the chocolate with some kind of a biscuit inside, and this it has various tastes as well. You can easily get them in Japan. And another uh, tea box from. I quite enjoyed their um, Earl Grey. And on, this is another random uh, kind of uh, sticker selection. Well, Orbits are <laughs> even gum. I think I I had it from like long time ago trip in Georgia, I think. So and I kept it and I, I just decided to put it here because it's nice and yeah just lots of uh, various kinds of um, labels. I think this is from even Myanmar. My friend got the powdered milk tea from there and I I I I cut it out from their bag. And famous Hyoko um snack from Fukuoka and Haribo <laughs> and another uh, da the Daman Ferrer tea bag selection and Twinings I like Twinings and this is another famous um, cookie uh, Ebi Senbe Ebi Senbe is uh, um, cookie or not cookie it's a snack that is uh, made with some um, dried shrimp so it, it tastes like shrimp and it's very very crunchy and it's really really nice uh, it goes very well with Japanese green tea well to be honest best combination will be beer but <laughs> for as a tea lover uh, or tea recommend <laughs> render um, I suggest drink uh, if you have some 
Abby Samba and then uh, try with, with green tea goes quite well and uh, these are the wrapping paper of that Abby Sambe and this is actually the <laughs> I put this together like this and then this is the frog uh, the reason I made this is uh, I got inspired as a spring uh, I wanted to express spring with the tea bags and and this paper is even from some kind of um, um, cookie or snack that I enjoy with tea and I, I made this uh, page as a spring and this is uh, summer as you can guess this uh, this blue is swimming pool and this uh, pink is the tube that you use when you have fun in the swimming pool and these are the just another tea bag selection from Twinings. And yeah, this page is about the autumn. As you can see, these are the ginkgo leaves. And oh my god, the maple cream cookie. I really, 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 really love this. And unfortunately, I. I can't really find these in, in Korea and um, yeah I want to visit Canada to, just to get these even jeez I missed it so much uh, for this uh, I got this from my friend who lives in Canada and I, I don't know I can't keep on asking to my friend to send this so I'm not doing it still maybe I will have to do it soon because uh, just looking at this uh, I wanting me to eat them again and these are another just a uh, page that I got puzzles and just small notes an Australian afternoon I uh, yeah I once lived in Australia and sometimes and whenever my friend who lives in Australia come back to Korea uh, they bring me this because uh, they know I love tea and I miss Australia and tea another tea bag this was quite unique I thought uh, with this uh, shape of the tea tail tea bag tail and yeah this is a <laughs> this is the winter I should have made this with the paper of a tea bag that contains lots of white or blue or sky blue, whatever. But um, I don't know. I just tried it with the Lipton yellow tea bag. Be uh, probably because I drank most often at the time. <laughs> And um, this is the chocolate um, wrapping paper. I found this color very attractive and then the design of the paper. Nice. And um, this is another... This, these are actually all, all um, chamomile tea bag. I, all the various the tea brand were... Um, having this chamomile tea uh, this is Ahmed selection tea tea bag and um, with the older red uh, tea tea bag tail I made this lovely heart <laughs> and um, kinder chocolate and these are the Lonefeld tea bag collection Unfortunately, this is missing because I only have the one of these. And this is tea box from uh, Vietnam. Vietnam produce quite nice oolong tea these days. So check them out. And um, yeah, just another tea bag selections from various kinds of um, brand. And these are mostly big loads. Uh, just another page of the stickers that I uh, information of the tea box from the tea box 
and uh, yeah, just uh, stickers and uh, a lotus leaf tea that I got from Vietnam. Oh, this is the tea box from Georgia. And this is the green tea, like kind of a blending with with the nice uh, like fresh berries blending green tea. And I think this was this was I got this from Georgia as well. Oh, Snoopy cookie that I got from Universal Studio Japan. And uh, remember the this green chocolate. Um, it's, these are from same um, company, I think. I think I got this from my friend, and I found this when I was traveling. So I was quite happy to find them and and got it. Uh, bean, sweet bean, kind of a uh, tea fruit that I enjoyed. I thought this wrapping paper was pretty. Yeah, it continues to do with this. I think that's where the where the story is coming from the wrapping paper. Japan has good storytelling method, I think. And um, this is very famous uh, white chocolate um, snack cookie. It has a really um, it's called um, yeah I I enjoyed it. It's from Japan. Um, this is white chocolate. This is green green tea chocolate. Well, not green chocolate, right? <laughs> And um, the famous uh, sugar, Le Pache from France. I like these uh, parrot uh, papers, wrapping paper. And tea, ba uh, tea, tea bag box from Japan. And um, this is the wrapping paper from the Lupicia, the tea that I am drinking. I like it. And another sticker selection that I got lots of um, like cookies and tea, tea wear brand and another tea brand and yeah. Another uh, tea fruit that I got from Japan, and these are um, I made this this letter uh, means tea um, with the tea bag tea bag tail de cha. This is Korean actually. Hangul cha means tea. And look at this cute uh, skull. I, I like I like this. And some more tea bag selection. Ah, <sighs> the chocolate that I did. I I don't want to forget. This was really really good. And this is the chestnut, sweet chestnut. And uh, this is the box. And this was the wrapping. And I found this really pretty, the paper with this chestnuts and the uh, birds inside. And this is the letter T in Chinese, and finally English T. Um, yeah, famous Earl Grey, and um, another more tea bags. From trainings and these are poor tea. Uh, they have small, uh, small round uh, poor tea that is for like one one time portion. And these are wrapping paper from them. They have a uh, different size and the various letters too. And uh, spring selection cup holder. And this is the Chinese tea that was made like chocolate. It was the box. And Oriental Beauty. 
and some more boxes and wrapping paper that I found very fascinating and this tea was quite good quite refreshing especially in the summer with the iced tea this is really good and I found this pattern very fascinating and pretty so I didn't want to let go yeah this too pretty pattern box and Blesna's white tea it was it, I quite enjoyed it enjoy drinking them and these are another like uh, all these labels that I got That's pretty much about it, I think. Some more papers that I haven't finished making um, or doing anything yet, but um, hopefully I will get to do it soon. Yeah, as you can see, it's quite, it's not quite thick and lot I've been making this um, scrapbook for a few years now I don't do this that much anymore but looking at this maybe I should get back to it sometime but in a different form probably on my on my traveler's notebook or something like that anyway Hope you enjoyed my uh, flip through scrapbook of my tea, tea time. And yeah, I will get back to you on the next video. Thank you very much for watching and enjoy your tea time always. Bye bye.